my goodness, this is so sweet. Oh, how special. Oh my goodness. I'm literally just gonna cry, I can't. <laughs> this is so nice. We are staying in a $3,000 a night room at the best resort in Mexico. I cannot wait to show you around. This is the open air lobby and you take Mexico's only privately owned tunnel to get here. They have golf carts to take you to the other side of the tunnel if you wanna go into town, get dinner or something. And when we first arrived, literally we didn't even step out of the car and they were handing us margaritas, taking our luggage out. And we didn't see it again until we walked into our room. The concierge is here as well. And in general, the service has just been amazing. What a beautiful way to enter the resort. I just love the desert cactuses on the ocean with the mountains behind, the landscape is so unique. This is the agave study. They do tequila and mezcal classes. And at night, it's just so beautiful. This cabinet opens up and there's all these high-end tequilas in these beautiful bottles. And there's someone standing there willing to answer any question. There's also twinkle lights and like the fire kicks on and it's just such an awesome place to enjoy the night. This is the coffee shop or coffee lab as they call it. Its name is Neutral and they have the cutest little setup with all these pastries in there and this little swigging table with like lids and sugar and stirs and everything. I got a chai latte and it is delicious. They also have coffee making classes in there. $14 chai latte. <laughs> What? How do people get that every day? I better save for this. This is the boutique. They have some designer clothes and lots of beautiful pieces of art from local artists. One thing I didn't know about Cabo is all of the hand-blown glass. It seems like a big part of the culture here. And even at this resort, all of the cups and the pitchers are all hand-blown, beautiful glasswork. And you can buy all that stuff in the boutique as well. Not that I could afford it, but it's really nice to window shop. This is more of that hand-blown glass I was talking about on almost every tree here they have these beautiful ornaments and you can also buy them in the gift shop and they're not that bad which is even better <laughs> this is the gym we haven't been in it yet but it seems like everyone else has every morning we see people with their workout clothes on heading over here and honestly it's just so motivating they also have workout classes on the beach and yoga classes so it seems like a lot to take part in if that's something you're interested in this is the kids pool and it's hands down my favorite pool on the property. It just looks like this cute little swimming hole. It has a waterfall and the view of the casitas with the mountain behind from here is just incredible. This is the beach club. They serve poolside lunch and snacks. They're open till six. So Will and I actually had an early dinner in there one night and it was a really great option for a casual low key spot. The portions are also huge. And what's really nice is I think that they're willing to split meals they're a little pricey, so if you're not that hungry but want a snack, it's nice that they're more than willing to accommodate. This is the family pool. It's also got the resort's only hot tub, and it has a beautiful infinity edge looking out to the ocean. Behind me is the spa, and to my right is the spa pool. We unfortunately won't be going just because the prices are really high, but I hear it's amazing and world-class. Over here are two private chase lounges that literally lay down to be like a queen size bed. They also have gorgeous views of the ocean. You do have to pay extra for those and rent them, but not sure why you would because there's plenty of other seats here. There really doesn't feel like there's a lot of people at all. I think everyone having a private plunge pool definitely helps, but the chairs by the pool are super comfortable and you never really have to worry about running down and saving a seat or anything. And there's this white covering over them that they change for every single person. Literally, as soon as someone gets up, they run over and they put a new one on. It's super clean and sanitary here and the service has been incredible. Also, everyone gets complimentary water bottles while sitting at the pool. And the first day we were here, they came over and served all these snacks. So the service has just been unreal. This is the resort's private stretch of beach and it is just beautiful. They have some lounge chairs down here where they still serve you water and bring towels. 
Not many people sit down here because you can't go in the water, but I still think it's so nice to put my toes in the sand. Behind me, there's a champagne bar with these really fun swinging chairs, and it's just the perfect place to get a drink at sunset. Behind me is Don Manuel's. They serve breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and everything has been incredible so far. Since we're Diamond members, we've gotten the included continental breakfast, which comes with fruit, pastries, and one meal. So it's either hot cereal, which is oatmeal, cold cereal, or yogurt and granola. We've had the oatmeal and the yogurt. Both have been amazing. I think today we're going to upgrade it. It's $20 per person to get the full hot breakfast. They have a buffet with lots of breads and omelet station, and you can order some other specialty hot breakfast items. I think you can get like chili quiles and huevos rancheros. So really looking forward to ordering that. Dinner is also spectacular. We celebrated our anniversary there and it is just so incredible. I can't even explain it. Being on this infinity pool and seeing the ocean in the distance, the setting is unreal and it was such a spectacular dinner. In front of me is the adults only pool, which is huge. There's a gorgeous swim up bar and these really cute little tables in the water. It has an infinity edge and just the views of the ocean from here are incredible. I love that you can like walk up to the edge with your drink and literally see whales out there. We've been seeing whales every single day that we've been here and it's just incredible. We also see these flying mobile rays, which are so cute. They like flop out of the water and do their little flapper wings. It's so cute. Will got some really great footage with this drone that we're very excited to show you guys. <laughs> How beautiful is this restaurant? This is El Ferion, the resort's signature restaurant and we are eating dinner here tonight. If you wanna see our full meal, be sure to subscribe. It's gonna be amazing. We've literally seen the fishermen working so hard this morning, catching fish for tonight. So I cannot wait. Well, now for the moment you've all been waiting for, let's go check out our room. Walking into the room, you first enter this beautiful foyer. There's also a bottle of Classe Azul waiting for you. It's handcrafted just for the Waldorf Astoria and comes with two matching cups, a tray, and a box of cashews. We have really been enjoying that when we come back from dinner every night. Moving on into the room, there is this huge wardrobe, plenty of space for us to put our things. We put our luggage in there, hung up all our clothes. There's two big drawers. There's also an iron and an ironing board in there, an umbrella in case it rains, and they gave us a bag as a little welcome gift. Next, we have this beautiful fireplace, which might seem a little bit off being that we're on the beach in Mexico. This whole room is kind of more themed to be like a cabin. The ceiling is wood and there's deep browns and mahoganies. Everything just feels like a little bit like a lodge. I think it's beautiful, but it's not your typical like like beach vacation room where it's all nice and clean and modern and white. Now onto the coffee nook. There's an espresso machine and everything you need to make your morning cup of coffee. There's a mini fridge. It's complimentary and fully stocked every day. There's an alarm clock, which is also a Bluetooth speaker. Really looking forward to using that later while we're out by the pool watching the waves. There's an ice bucket, wine glasses, and these beautiful cocktail cups as well. I love that it's hand blown glass. They're just so beautiful to me. And there's a safe so you can put all your valuables away. The bed is so comfortable, the perfect firmness. We've been sleeping so good at night. On the left side of the bed, there's North American outlets and USBs. There's also no master switch, but there's turn down service every night. So it's really nice because you don't really have to worry about shutting off the lights. They do all of that for you. They put out your robe and slippers. It's really cute. Also wanted to mention when we first got here, they had pedals, all over the place and a little heart on the bed, all the lights turned down and candles everywhere. And it was just so touching. They did that all because we're celebrating our anniversary and they even left a little handwritten note with a gift on it. And it's just so sweet. They're making it so special for us and really going above and beyond. Now, let me show you the bathroom. I love this bathroom. It's all open concept and I love the cabin feel in here as well. They have rich woods and the attention to detail is incredible. I love how the soap dish and the tissue box match the sinks. There's double sinks in here and behind each one there's North American outlets, which have been working great with my blow dryer. And behind is the shower, which is also all open. There's no shower curtain or anything. There's a really cute bench here. The products smell so good. We've been really enjoying those. And then there's a bathtub which they left honey if you wanted to soak with that. Seems super luxurious. And the robes, just to mention as well, are 
so comfortable. Oh my goodness, I've been loving just hanging out in my robe at night. Also wanted to mention the toilet over here. It has its own door in case you don't wanna shut the whole door for the bathroom and have some privacy, you're able to do that. Okay, now on to my favorite part of the room and what you're probably spending all your money on. How beautiful is this back terrace? We have our own private plunge pool, a beautiful view of the ocean, this very comfy furniture and a table to eat our chips and guac on. Chips and guac and these little Corona Eats come every day from four to five and it's just the perfect way to end the day and the perfect appetizer before dinner. Sometimes we even eat it in the pool as well and it's just so nice to be able to take in these beautiful ocean views and look at the wildlife out there. We've seen whales every single day. It seems like every time we look out at the ocean, we see something. They're breaching or we see their beautiful tail or we've even seen rays like flying out of the water. It's crazy. It's just unreal to be able to see all that just right outside of our hotel room. They also give us these binoculars, which we honestly don't even really need, but in case you want more of an up close view, you can get it with these. Speaking of, chips and guac just got here. Can't wait to munch on these and then head to dinner. We're going to El Ferion tonight to celebrate our anniversary. So if you wanna see that video, be sure to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you in the next one.